Hello, and welcome to some USF 2000 at Summit Point. Uh, it feels like we were just here. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I've done this combo already, which is interesting, because I just recently got into these USF 2000s. So, it's kind of curious. Um, I'm pretty sure I've done this combo already. So, uh, I guess that should give us a little bit of an advantage, I would hope. Um, <laughs> I uh, have some best times already I've been challenging myself against and set some new personal bests, which is always good. Uh, I love having a personal best laps to kind of compete against in it and uh, see if I can improve. It's kind of like a... Whoa, don't overdrive. It's kind of like a uh, surefire way to say like, oh, hey, I've definitely improved. I've got a, a new all-time best lap. So that's always fun. Um, see if we can pull together a decent lap here in qualifying. We are the number two, and I'm fresh off of the Arca race at Lime Rock, where we got Chicken Streaker. <laughs> Won't say any anything else okay. beyond that if you haven't seen it yet. But uh, I was doing well in that one. I was in the lead at one point. <laughs> okay, no spoilers in case you haven't seen it. <laughs> but um, hopefully we'll have ourselves another good run here. A little bit slower on entry there, get a good run off though. Don't go offside, okay. Almost pushed it too hard, as the tires are still kind of getting up to temp here. I believe the last race I did here was when we got stuck behind the chatterbox, <laughs> who was uh, more interested in chatting on the voice chat than racing, and he was in front of us, like, blocking every lane, just having a nice casual drive while I'm, like, exploding in anger, <laughs> trying to pass him. More frustration than anger. And then uh, I tried so hard to pass him that I spun out. <laughs> so that was really frustrating. Hopefully, uh... Things go a little bit better than last time, in that regard. Um, okay lap there, not completely satisfied with that. Let's see if we can uh, do even better here. Kind of got it sideways there. We'll put up session best here so we can compare it to our last Q lap. See if we can improve. Two tenths down on the first lap now. The guy behind has just done a one ten point five. Getting through this sector pretty good. This is one of those sections where you gotta get them all right. Or else you kind of fall apart. <laughs> so we'll get about a tenth on our uh, previous lap. Not too bad. That is a 110. Oh. P2. That lap time was 110.1. Chicken flag. Chicken flag. Not my best lap. I've been able to get in the 109s, but um, when the pressure's on and you got two laps to do your best. I think just uh, just barely into the 110s is fine. We'll do a little bit extra practice here, so I'm not just looking at a boring screen, waiting for everyone else to finish up. Ooh, almost shifted down too early into second there, got sideways. I guess I should say I almost did it too early and spun but instead I did it too early and got sideways. That's what happened. It's, uh... You know, pretty good. These, this car's always so much fun to drive, so... I'm sure I'll have a good old time, even if I don't finish too good. Let's see, we are qualified third right now. 
Number one's pretty darn fast. So we're gonna have to hope they're inconsistent, because if they're hitting 1096s every lap, that's gonna be a tough task <laughs> to keep up with. Feeling good though, and of course the uh, car gets faster as time goes on, as the tires heat up, and the uh, car gets lighter. This thing tends to get faster. I just gotta avoid the snap. I gotta avoid it snapping on me and causing me a crash. And uh, if I start P3, that's pretty good. I'm happy with that. Alright, that was the best uh, third sector I've had, or at least better than I did on my all-time best there. Hey, and it's time for the race! So, officially P3. We're very close on speed with the number 3. And uh, these guys aren't too far behind either. These guys in the 110s, they can, they'll all be able to keep up, I'm sure, at race pace. Uh, beyond that, you know, maybe the 10 just had a bad qualifying, maybe they'll keep up, but the 128, unless they purposely just wanted to be the, uh, ahead of all the guys that don't qualify, that might be, uh, questionable. Hey! Good luck, everyone. It's the number 7, that's the guy that chicken streakered me. <laughs> that's hilarious. Okay. I don't have any, I promise you, I don't have any, like, Bad well, blood ram. It was an honest mistake, you know. But that's quiet. hilarious that he happened to join. Of all series, he happened to join. Um, next one that I did. He never apologized either. Shakes fist in the air. How dare you? Maybe I will hold a grudge. If I don't get an apology. <laughs> Who cares, anyway? I don't. I'm just gonna race. Have some fun. So, we got rolling starts here. Hopefully we survive. It's always an adventure. You've heard this story before. I feel like I've, I've started saying the same exact things every every video, so I've got to switch it up and start talking about something else or something. Like, uh... Those tires. Pretty neat, right? Yeah, I'm out of topics. I'm sorry. <laughs> What I do hope is that we get started soon, which we are. About 15 seconds. And uh, the cold tires aren't as bad in the USF 2000, as far as I can tell. Maybe I just am less experienced with this car, so I haven't been quite as uh, familiar with the differences. But it seems they're not quite as impactful as like say, the Mazda, which I'm very used to. And the way that the cold tires just it never wants to turn. On cold tires and the Mazda. Oh god. We got someone doing the brake check thing. I'm just gonna do the drag the brakes to get the squeaky out. That'll probably be fine. Just gotta watch out for this guy doing brake checks. They got my volume kind of low, so it's kind of hard to even hear my brakes if they're squeaking or whatever, but it's really, really not a big deal. It's kind of just something to do while doing the pace lap. Like, drag the brake a little bit and get the brakes warmed up so they're at peak performance. I know it matters more in some cars than others. I don't know how much it affects this one, but... Let's see, I got my uh, brake price right, don't I? Okay, 50.1, yes, that's where I like it. Try to move it down, move it back, I mean, the front brake bias. Because um, this car likes to lock up the tires. So, I got it at 50.1, it seems to work fine for me. No issues there. I always look at the back of this of, of the cars here, and I see like it looks like the Illuminati like pyramid. <laughs> the 
got uh, the Illuminati in the race. Bum bum bum. So uh, if I don't finish well, it's a conspiracy against me, obviously. Oh, yep, just brake check me. That's fun. So nice of him to be so trusting of me. To pay attention and hit the brakes whenever he's just gonna be slamming on it. Us people are... <laughs> people are running into each other back there, apparently. Someone sent out a canned message. Good luck, please be careful. Racing incident, sorry Get about ready. that. Get ready, going green. <laughs> so we get a good jump. Okay, okay the car is go. ready. Time to do your job. Gross. Slowing down. Supposed to do that, supposed to maintain a consistent pace, but he does what he wants because he's the leader, I guess. I just overtook the guy on the left. Go, go, green flag, green flag. I could eat a black flag. That's 15 minutes. No. Weird. I didn't mean to. I thought he would hit the gas whenever the guy went, to be honest. Well, we don't get a black flag, but... Not really what I want to do. That seems kind of cheap. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Taking the spot from the guy immediately. Like I said, I thought he would, you know, go. Whenever the guy went. Oh well. We can't worry about that now. We got racing to do. A little bit easier on, the, on these corners early on because the cold tires. Ooh, one almost wrecked it. You see that? Really messed up that corner. That can be enough for us to get alongside him or anything, but uh, I don't think I want to do that anyway because I have the feeling this guy's gonna pretty handily outpace us in this race. But maybe he'll string me along a little bit with his draft. Help me be faster than I should be. Oh, I did not hit the brakes as much as I needed to to get it pitched a little bit. Get through that corner. I'll get up bit and I spin. I always spin in this corner. Every time, man. God, I stink. Kenji, wait for me. The leader has just done 109.9. I can't, you're too fast. Sorry about my spin there, guys. I hope I didn't get anyone okay, too Colton. bad. The next car is Watkins. Uh, I'm terrible in this car, man. I always crash it. I think we got like a broken front wing, but... Gotta just keep going. I think we're still fast enough to... I don't know, we're pretty slow on power or something, though. I always crash in that freaking corner. I swear, I think about it, too, during practice. And it never happens in practice, and then I get in the race, and then what do you know? Oh yeah, this thing's not turning right. This thing's broken. <sighs> Not turning right, it's down on speed. God. I'm trash. You've just yeah, we're losing multiple tents down the straightaways.
We're just gonna have to uh, try to get speed where we can. Being, entering the corner softer means maybe I can get better runs off more easily. I don't know. Just try to be fast regardless. Looks like we're still catching some guys ahead. What am I doing wrong in this corner? Why do I always snap in this corner? It's not even like a cold tires thing, because the last time it happened to me, it was trying to pass the guy later, like pretty late in a run, so it wasn't like, you know, something about that corner, I'm just snapping. Seven went off a little bit there. It's the guy that crashed me in Arca. I think we uh, might still be able to pass him now with this race. <laughs> with our broken car. Gonna have to be patient here though. Swerving all over. <laughs> all over both lanes, man. Okay, all bye. Right, clear. <laughs> just drove off, I guess. I don't know if he was trying to let me buy or if he just overdrove it and locked up the brakes or something. I don't know what that was. Off. Well, do we have any chance? The number four. I mean, there's always the chance for people to uh, crash, of course. But will we catch anyone pace? Let's see, 12 seconds back. I started this lap. We'll look at it again. Since it's time for the next lap. So we're not going to be setting all time best laps. Really? We'll just do session best. Now we got someone crash. Yeah. I'm assuming, unless that was just a move that someone Thank was not you for the damage. We damaged each other, it sounds like. I guess I just got to get on the uh, throttle a little easier exiting that corner. Maybe I just don't realize it, but I'm getting Project on it too hard to in the heat of the race. Causes me to go around. This thing's definitely not turning right anymore, with the front wing damaged. You can tell it's not cutting through the air in the corners properly. So it would appear that... We're not going to catch anyone ahead on speed, but I think people did crash, maybe? See more smoke. We got someone that uh, lost some time, maybe went off course. We're going to need them to make multiple mistakes, though, because of our car's damage. Slow car ahead. I don't see it. I don't know if they got it right. Jack, right no. it. Just go. Okay, Colton. You're gaining on this car. The gap is 4.8. I don't know what's happening ahead of us, but we're just gonna have to pick up, pick off spots as they crash, potentially. What are you doing? Why would you park it like that? <sighs> just take the corner normally. I'll find my way around. He just like parks it where I like to enter the corner. Look at all this speed I lose on the straightaways. Like, I got through the front, the first corner pretty well, and then it just bleeds off because of all the speed I'm down on the straightaway. It's 
stinks. Yeah, I guess I guess what's happening probably to me in with this combo is that corner that I'm always crashing in. I think I just get caught up in the moment of the race. And I'm thinking about the guys around me and where I need to be on track and all that, and I'm getting on the gas too hard. Just stepping on it too hard. And I gotta remember to be easy on it right there. Every time. So we got this guy that's 4.7 ahead after he had a mistake. We'll see, uh... That lap was a 112.3. Sector 3 is... We'll be able to catch him or not. Five minutes remaining. Five minutes left. He's like... He's like in the mid fours. Bouncing around in... Distance. Oh, we got someone crashed. See that uh, relative counting down quick. Fastest lap for Yamamoto, 109.4. But uh, I think that they got back on it. Or maybe the relative's just going up and down like crazy, just because of because it's trying to calibrate, figure out how far they really are away. I think that actually might be the case. I might have just seen things, because it looked like it was dropping real quick, but I think it was just adjusting, so never mind. We are actually catching the number six. I think they might have damage as well. Only really three minutes left, though. I'm not sure if we're going to get there. But we'll try something to reach for. Try to salvage my horrible mistake. I hope I didn't damage anyone else too bad. I know that one guy ran into me, but we were going pretty slow at the time. I might have hurt their wing or something. Yamamoto, it was whatever if I make a mistake and hurt myself. I mean, that's my own fault. It really stinks. Oh my god, this thing doesn't turn anymore. Um, it really stinks as giving other people damage because of my stupid mistakes. Oh, we got a guy that. Oh, that's gonna be a spot. In eighth now, I think that's going to be seventh once we get around to the next lap, because that guy was in fourth ahead of us and then suddenly was in the pits, so they crashed, I guess. So we should get seventh at least, so we can bring it home. Thank you. Doing my best to drive oh, this no. thing. Uh oh. Bruh. What happened? Two minutes to go. Two minutes. What happened? I fucked that. I didn't think he'd be that slow. Sounds like we got more lap car trunks. On the one side I'm happy, on the other side I'm sad. We're a vulture. Picking off the dead. <laughs> I need this to be two to go if I have a chance of catching this guy. I think it is. So I think that'll be two to go now. I might have a chance to catch this guy, but it's going to be tough. We might get into his draft, though, and it might help us with our poor straightaway speed for a little bit. And that'll be nice. So obviously that's our big weakness right now, is just being so horribly slow on power.
You got a slow car on the right. Uh oh. What's happening up here? Crash guys, but still behind them. You got a slow car on the right. Go left. Okay. We'll see if we can hold him off. I think he's gonna pass us back though, unless he's got damage like we do. White flag. One more left to go. Well, he's only got one one left to do it. You're in fear. White flag. Last lap. That lap was at one eleven point seven. Well, we found a way to make this final lap interesting. This guy's crashing and whatnot. Oh, perfect time for the frames to drop. Thank you. Just what I needed. What is this guy Blue doing here? here? Go right. Get off the right line, mate. My bad. My headset went black. I believe that. He's been doing that all race. Good job, Captain. Thank you. Sounds like an excuse, because he's been a horrible lap car all race. Said. Car on your left. Still there, hold your line. Still there, hold your line. He's gonna motor me with my broken car. That stinks. Still there. <laughs> Try to help me. <laughs> P5. Yeah, good race. I uh, was doing my best with my broken car. It's on my own fault, though. Good race, guys. Good one. Great job. You did really well. Appreciate you giving me a bit of space on that corner. Yeah, I didn't need to cause more trouble. Fifth. Wow. Wish there was more of it. <sighs> I'm actually very surprised we actually pulled it back to fifth. Uh, Joel, I appreciate you wanted to let us buy, but going so slow is also dangerous. But I know what you wanted, so no offense to you. <laughs> yeah, that's foot towards him, I think he was uh, he was really struggling. All right, let's uh, yeah, I, let me just <laughs> fifth place. I cannot believe I just. Got fifth place. There must have been a lot of guys that crashed out and stuff. I cannot believe I managed to bring it back to fifth after how awful I was. Look at that. I just hit the bumps and. Ooh, that was the guy that ran into us. Who was it? This guy. He was still racing well until he crashed into someone, I think. So, I don't think I hurt anyone too bad. Yeah, they just got off his tires and got him off course. Not good, obviously, but. That didn't ruin his race. He ended up having trouble later. So uh, at least it was mostly just me. <sighs> Come on, man. You gotta practice more before you join a session. If you're going 20 miles an hour, you know, that's... Guys have to slam on the brakes for you. That's just like... <laughs> it's like a granny crossing the crosswalk while the cars have a green light. <laughs> <laughs> That's just dangerous. You gotta practice more and be more up to speed before you join a race. Let's see, let's see, let's get a little sideways. This is the guy that we almost got at the end there. Fourth place spins it. At least I'm not the only one spinning and having trouble. That was a an interesting way to get it spun around. <laughs> Gets there though. Yeah. And then let's have the 12 again. No. Okay, that's a different lap car. So the two is trying to make his way by. He just runs into the back of him. I remember he said on chat that, oh man, he. Thought it was gonna be faster through there. Yeah, we got a lot of different speeds in here and it's been causing some trouble. Ooh, and then he has more trouble and oh, <laughs> kills it. 
What happened? So this guy going horribly slow, but... I think he's seeing him and worrying about him too much and then ends up off the side there and then he... This is it. And I think he just gives up. Because <laughs> you see, it turns as the, he turns the wheel to the right and he's like, I'm just going to go off this ramp. <laughs> Which, I don't know if I would have done that. Because I think he still would have beat us. So where, I, where I'm having troubles in the corner before this, uh, number eight's having troubles in this corner because I think that's the second time they spawn there. So I have troubles here. This guy's having some issues around this corner, it seems like. Guess we all have our issue corners. Lord. 12, is that the 12 or the 10 this time? It's 12. Just horribly off pace. Like, if you angle that right, you can you can flat foot it through there. And then, like, he just has to slam on the brakes. <laughs> it's not funny. It's really not. But it kind of is a little bit. <sighs> so, I make a dumb mistake, but thankfully it mostly just affected me. And I somehow, I guess I because I did it so early in the race, I'm still able to come back and get fifth. And then, uh... See how close we got. <laughs> so I, I reached him, but just uh, not quite enough. I made sure to give him plenty of room because I'm not gonna risk crashing anyone. And uh, of course, we're down a power, so <laughs> he's gonna outmotor us. But I gave it my best shot, and uh, we actually were able to finish out of this guy, even though he was faster with, uh, I think his car was less broken. But he just, he crashed in the last lap or so, and so he would have had us, had we had one more lap. Heck, he would have had us at the end of that straightaway, so. Kind of fortunate to get a couple extra spots there, get a top five. Probably gonna lose eye rating still, maybe like one or two, or maybe I'll gain one or two. It's probably gonna break even for the most part, though, which is... Pretty nice, because I don't think I deserve it. I made a mistake. And I uh, got a 5x, another not so cool road race following the Chicken Streak of Deluxe race. But um, hey, it is what it is. So thanks for watching me be terrible. <laughs> um, hopefully, my next run, wherever it may be, is a little bit better. But uh, I will see you next time. And uh, hopefully I won't be self-spinning in that race. <laughs> oh, good one.